Could evolution bring about psychophysical harmony? That is, could we evolve towards psychophysical harmony and away from psychophysical disharmony? No, here's why. Evolution it makes the physical world look a certain way. It makes creatures better suited to their environments, enhances their chances of survival, and so on. But getting psychophysical harmony requires getting very specific mental things, like qualia, to correspond with very specific physical things. But the physical and the mental are a priori probabilistically independent. So, it is impossible for evolution to increase the probability of psychophysical harmony. To illustrate, psychophysical harmony requires the existence of psychophysical laws that connect the physical world to harmonious experiences, but evolution can't control the psychophysical laws. For example, imagine that C fibers were connected to pleasure instead of pain. Unless we say that qualia violate the laws of physics, we would expect the physical world to play out the same way. Creatures that got damaged would have their C fibers fire and they would avoid getting damaged in the future. The physical behavior would be the same, but the qualia would be different. Evolution wouldn't behave any differently. And if we do say that qualia violate the laws of physics in some way, evolution doesn't tell us how they violate the laws of physics. Maybe whenever our bodies get damaged, it would be evolutionarily helpful if physics were violated in such and such a way. And lo and behold, the quail of pain does violate the laws of physics in this way. But it's just as likely, a priori, that the quail of pleasure is what would violate the laws of physics in this way. Evolution can't control which quail would have this useful physics violating power. So it's just as likely that evolution would want us to experience pain or pleasure when we damaged our bodies. At the end of the day, no matter what evolution does, it can only influence the physical world, and this, by itself, cannot ensure psychophysical harmony, because you need specific psychophysical laws to match the world to harmonious qualia and mental stuff. No matter how evolution plays out, you can always find tons of a priori, epistemically possible psychophysical laws that would connect the physical stuff in that world to disharmonious experiences.